Now, if you can find me value when it comes to Umar Namagomedov against uh, Vexad Almakan here, I mean, when you're looking at the, the size favorite that Umar is at minus 1250, oh my goodness. Okay, Maddie, you found it. And again, you got a 1250 betting favorite, and somehow you found a way to almost get five to one on set favorite. This is what you do, Maddie. Tell the people what you have. I understand it. I really don't like <laughs> we just saw we just saw Umar's uh left, I think it was a left hook mm-hmm. against Ronnie Barcellus. It was so yes. it was so fast, so explosive out of nowhere. Like we I mean I get that. I guess odds makers just think he's just gonna go right to the ground and sub this dude, which is definitely a possibility, but I don't get it. You're gonna give me plus four seventy five on the knockout. Like, um, I almost feel like Umar is like, nobody wants to fight me. And he's just going to come out, show the hands, show the kicks. Like, I think he just starches him. Plus 475 is insane for this dude striking on a minus 1600 favorite. I, I don't get it. So I'm going to take you know, it. I love it. And, and we see this all the time, guys, right? Where all of a sudden, you know, what am I supposed to do? What, what's my specialty, right? I think of John Jones, and I'm not saying that Umar and Magomedov is John Jones. Uh, level talent, but he is he is kind of <laughs> thought of to be on next levels. They want to show things that they haven't shown before. And Kyle, I think this is really playable here that Maddie's got because I love that mentality of, oh, you think I'm just a submission guy or I'm going to take him to the distance and rag on for 15 minutes? No, I'm going to finish him. I, I remember Patty Pimple doing it when he's supposed to be a sub guy and then it gets a KO and I lose on that. I'm starting to pick up what Maddie's putting down here. I think it's a really smart play for a guy that's a massive favorite. Yeah, I'm red buttoning it right now. I didn't even realize that's what they had the KO number at. Uh, the submission number is minus 135. But full disclosure, I personally believe I love me some cousin Umar. Okay. I think he is the best fighter in the UFC. I think he's the eventual champion. I think pound for pound, he's the best guy. This dude is an absolute stud everywhere. I don't see anyone in that division or anyone who came to his weight who would beat him. I think he will end up being better than Khabib, hot take. I think he will end up being better than Khabib. I love me some Cousin Umar. I cannot wait to watch Cousin Umar fight. This is my dude. And the plus 475 by knockout is just, if you're not, and I don't know a lot about uh, Beck. Bekzat Almakan. I know it's uh-huh. his uh, debut here, and he's got that perfect record. And, you know, they that's another way to prop up Umar Namagamedov. But Maddie's right. That knockout over Roni Barcellos. And again, Roni's, you know, you saw last week, things are popping in and out all the time on that guy, uh, you know, mm-hmm. title of our sex tape there. But uh, nonetheless, uh, that plus four. So anytime you're getting a guy who just knocked out a seasoned guy and Roni Barcellos, just knocked him out, he's a. I mean, the number's crazy. It's probably going to be minus 2,000 by the time the fight comes around, and you're getting plus 475 on the knockout. Sign wow. me up. There's a world, world too, where he gets him down, almost gets the sub, and just grounds and pounds him and, and gets a knockout that way. So uh, I think it's a great number. Let's red button that, plus 475. There's a lot of meat Man. on that bone. Sign me up. Uh, Someone quick, tell me. I, I don't know. What's the inside the distance number right now on BetUS? Because I don't understand. Like I think it's like minus 170 or something. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's just a delay. fight not to go the distance is minus 160. Yep. Oh, so that's not even Umar by finish. Yeah, that's just anybody to finish yep. minus 160. What's Umar by finish? Umar by KO by submission. Let's see. By KO or submission is minus 145. And that'd be a better way to take it too than the money line. That's not bad. I mean, either. can someone explain to me why I shouldn't like liquidate everything I own and put it on Umar inside the distance? Mm-hmm. Seriously. The, the feels, only worry it, is it feels is super gotta, cheap. Uh, uh, it feels super inexpensive. Right. The only the, the only problem there would be is if we go the cards and he just can't for whatever reason yeah. finish this new game, right? Yeah, and you're gonna give me a freaking heart attack, dude. I can't be just don't do that. Don't do that. You already do this stuff. Because you're gonna uh, give us a heart attack, man. Yeah, don't do you're it. You're gonna give us a heart attack. I think I'm doing it. I, I'm gonna at least <laughs> Umar I think I'm gonna at least go. I'm going big on it. I'm going big on it. All right. Yeah. Well, just for solidarity, then red button that for me too. Then I'm in with Maddie as well. We'll get the buttons out. It's great. We're gonna go inside the distance. All right. All right well, why now? We're going. We're rolling with our guy Maddie Betts here inside the distance on Umar. So you're gonna have a. Oh, you have a full unit play, uh, Maddie. Umar by KO at plus four seventy five. That's also a red button for Kyle at plus four seventy five and. 
We're all going to go. <laughs> I love the BAMs on the group text right now. Mm-hmm. And we're going to go inside the distance here for Umar minus a dollar, a dollar 45 for all Absolutely. three of us. All three of us. We're yes. all, we're all in on that as well. Mm-hmm. So again, Umar, just get it done. We don't care how just, get, we prefer it KO obviously. So all the bets hit, but let's just go ahead and get this thing finished before we hit 15 and get to the judges scorecard. So red buttons all around for this one. Light up that board, baby. Absolutely love where we're going there.